Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of To The Point. Today's topic of discussion is 16th BRICS Summit in Russia. First of all, let's see why is it in the news. Prime Minister Narendra Modi will visit Russia from 22nd to 23rd October 2024. This visit is part of the 16th BRICS Summit, which will take place in Kazan under Russia's chairmanship. This year's summit themed Strengthening Multilateralism for Just Global Development and Security will be a significant platform for dialogue among the BRICS nations. Now let's discuss that what is BRICS. BRICS is an informal group comprising Brazil, Russia, India, China, and South Africa. In 2001, Jim O'Neill, an analyst at Goldman Sachs, coined the term BRIC to describe the emerging economies of Brazil, Russia, India, and China. Embracing the term, the first BRICS summit was held in Yekaterinburg, Russia on 16th June 2009. The group was formed to bring together the fastest growing developing countries to address their concerns and counter international institutions dominated by Western powers. It became BRICS in 2010 with the joining of South Africa. Earlier in 2024, the bloc welcomed five new members Egypt, Ethiopia, Iran, Saudi Arabia, and the United Arab Emirates. Significance of BRICS The expanded group has a combined population of about 3.5 billion, that is 45% of the world's population. The combined economies of the member states are worth more than $28.5 trillion, that is about 28% of the global economy. With Iran, Saudi Arabia, and the UAE becoming members, BRICS countries produce 44% of the global crude oil. BRICS aims to establish an open, transparent, inclusive, non-discriminatory, and rule-based multilateral trading system. Now let's discuss about the significance of BRICS for India. India's participation in the 2024 BRICS Summit holds significant importance for its strategic interest. It enhances India's role as a global leader and supports its vision for a multipolar world order. The summit provides a platform for India to strengthen ties with key nations, particularly Russia and China, despite existing geopolitical tensions. It allows India to advocate for reforms in international institutions, aligning with its aspirations for permanent membership in the UN Security Council. Additionally, India's involvement in discussions about economic cooperation can bolster trade and investment opportunities among member countries. The summit serves as a counterbalance to Western influence, enabling India to collaborate with emerging economies on shared development goals. Now lastly, moving on to way forward. BRICS diplomacy focuses on development that fits with India's core interest, energy security, fighting terrorism, climate change financing. PN Modi's visit comes at a time when India's diplomatic ties with the BRICS nations are growing stronger, with particular emphasis on economic collaboration and shared global leadership. Now moving on to practice question. Consider the following statements about BRICS. 1. The 16th BRICS Summit will take place in Kazan under Russia's chairmanship. 2. Recently, the bloc welcomed five new members, Egypt, Eritrea, Pakistan, Saudi Arabia, and the United Arab Emirates. Which of the statements given above is or are correct? One only, two only, both one and two, or neither one nor two? Send the answer of this question in the comment section. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.
For more informative content, like, share and subscribe and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications.